Morning Sunshines, the Pokemon trading card game Pocket is now out in New Zealand, but New Zealand only. However, us here at the Blaine's channel, we do always come out with these ways to get around those restrictions so you guys can also play this game now a month early. Yes, that's what this video is all about. You're going to be able to download and play Pokemon TCG Pocket right now on your own mobile phones. I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Now, just a little exclaimer, disclaimer. Uh, I don't know about Apple. I, it seems much easier on Apple than it is on Android. I'm going to be showing Android. So if you guys are looking for Apple, I'm afraid you're going to have to look elsewhere. I never use Apple. So either way, this is going to be for Android. I'm going to show you everything you need to do on your Android phone in order to get this working. And it's quite straightforward and easy enough. So let's get to it. For the demonstration, just so you can clearly see the screen, I'm going to be using a mobile emulator. However, this is going to be the exact same thing you do on your own mobile phone. I've done it on my own mobile phone and I will show some games play of me doing that on my own mobile phone after I show how to do this. So step number one, folks, you're going to want to download three different things. One is Tunnel Bear, which is the uh, <laughs> that right there with the little bear icon. And another one is the X APK installer. Both of those things can be found right here in the Google Play Store. All right, so let's go look for Tunnel Bear. No spaces. That's a VPN that's free to use, which you'll be able to download straight there upon the search. The other thing is XAPK Installer. That's another one, APK Installer. You can search for that in your Google Play Store. And uh, that will uh, search for a Google Play Store. That will come up here. You'll see it right there. And that's already installed for me. So that's what you want to get your hands on. The final one, folks, is, of course, the app itself, the APK for Pokemon TCG Pocket. You're going to have to find the APK yourselves. It looks like videos who have been showing this by also providing links for that have been getting taken down. Uh, so I'm going not, not going to do that here. However, folks, Central Leaks has a link for that. There are other just Google searches that will bring you to where you need to go for that. And and that's, it's pretty easy to find, folks, all right? It's pretty easy to find. So go ahead and find that using your in-phone uh, browser, okay? Search on your on-phone browser because you're gonna wanna download it on your phone. And if anyone needed the link there, there's a little tip, a hint for <laughs> where you wanna go. Uh, Anani M file, all right? Check it out, give it a Google, you'll find it. Like I said, folks, I don't wanna provide the link on my video itself because uh, it looks like those kind of videos are getting taken down. So we'll see how far I pushed it with that much information. After you've gotten those three things done, go ahead and install Pokemon TCG Pocket by using the XAPK installer. I'll show you guys what you have to do here. So it can be a little confusing for people who are not familiar with this. Open up the XAPK installer. This is completely free. So when this screen comes up, just hit the X up at the top left and you're gonna have maybe an ad or two ads, which you can skip the video after a few seconds or hit an X that will appear over here. I didn't have any this time. And then you'll be able to install the XAPK file for Pokemon uh, TCG here in the top option. Here's an ad right here. So this will be good to showcase. Uh, there's an X up at the top right there. Look for those X's. And the files that you're looking for should be here. You're gonna hit the green button right there to download and install it. Uh, sorry, you've already downloaded it, but you'll wanna hit the green button there to install it, all right? It's about 207 megabytes or around that. So make sure you know what your file looks like and that's that. After you've done that, you'll have the app appear on your phone, on your screen, but don't open it yet. First thing we're gonna do is go Tunnel Bear. And here we're going to select New Zealand, which is a free option to connect to folks. Uh, so just go to New Zealand and, or you can search for it here in the country. You can search for New Zealand. And what you're gonna wanna do is hit that right there and it should connect. But let me just disconnect from here first. Let me swap to a different country first just to showcase this. Now the app can be a little slow, all right? When it's grayed out, that's no good, uh, especially if it says connected down here and it's still gray out here, that's no good. So let's just try and connect it to New Zealand here. It's connected to Japan now, it's lit up. That means it's good, it's good, all right? Let's try New Zealand here, it's disconnected. Let's try and connect to New Zealand. It's a little clunky this app, but it works, it works. Just give it a sec. Connection secured, it's lit up. 
all right? It might take a little longer for some people, it depends, but either way, we got it working. And that's all you gotta do. Keep that app open, go to your home screen, and now you can open up Pokemon TCG. Once you've connected just fine, folks, go ahead back into your Pokemon trading card game app here now, for the first time, of course, and uh, this should be able to just open up straight up now. And that's really all it is. It's very simplistic. You'll get to start the game, you'll get to choose your age and go into it. Now, that's, that's really, that's it. I mean, that's it. Cool, now we can start. So here's me using my actual everyday phone right here. I'm gonna go ahead and connect to Australia. Urgh. New Zealand, I mean. <laughs> All right, so we connected to New Zealand on my actual everyday phone. As you can see, we're ready to go into the app, which is the Pokemon trading card app here. And I'm going to open up a pack in here so you can see it just working on my everyday phone. Uh, yes, it is mirrored. Sorry guys, just bear with me, it's fine. You're only gonna be looking at pictures anyway, there's no reading involved. Already played a little bit of this earlier, actually. Quite nice, got a couple of cards. Uh, we can open a booster pack. And uh, I'm gonna pick the Pikachu pack here. Let's go ahead and open this puppy. So, uh, there's a lot of like chance game in, in here. You can pick like one of the packs from any of these, this, this, this ring. Go ahead, let's, let's go ahead and pick this one. Let's open it up. See what we get here. We got double star, two diamonds, one diamond, one diamond. These are common, I guess. And the rare Zapdos X. Well, that's a nice one. That is a double gold star. That's actually a very good pick. Very nice. And guys, there's a lot of free content involved in this game. Well worth checking it out. Uh, that is how you'll play on your phones now, no matter where you are in the world. Well, everybody, I hope this was informative and useful for you. You can now all get to playing. Uh, there is no restrictions. It'll be a little sus when Pokemon wakes up tomorrow and finds that millions of people are playing their app, even though the population in New Zealand isn't really that high. <laughs> Blaine strikes again. Anyway, enjoy, folks. I'll see you around in the next Pokemon video whenever that happens. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye.